Hello and welcome back to Colonial Airstream. I'm Patrick Botticelli. Today is October 6th, 2023, and it is the Discover America sales event here at Colonial Airstream. This is for today and tomorrow. Today, I'm gonna to walk you through a whole bunch of Airstream travel trailers to show you what we have here. So come on. So what we have here is a brand new 2024 Airstream Classic 33 front bedroom twin. Beautiful trailer, power awning, zip D, sunbrella material, power stabilizing jacks. This has 200 amp hours of lithium battery batteries on board and 300 watts of solar. Woven vinyl flooring throughout. This is the comfort white interior decor. It's got the Earl Grey seating. This dinette folds down and makes into a bed. You got a sofa back here. A little armrest folds down, power recliners. You also have a desk workstation here, a power projection screen, center galley kitchen with solid surface countertop. You got a beautiful faucet over here, it comes with sink covers, lots of storage below. You can put your silverware in here, trash pail. You got a large drawer over here, another one over here. Three burner gas cooktop. It's got a microwave oven convection, cooktop ventilation. Check out this cool little pantry, slide out pantry. You'll see this in a lot of different Airstream models. 12 volt compressor style refrigerator and freezer. Up front, we have the twin beds. These are 34 by 80 and they power lift in the back. You got a TV, you got some roof locker storage and cabinet storage. Look at that panoramic view all the way around. Dual air conditioners on this. It's a dual 15,000 BTU. You also have hydronic heating system on board. In the back here, we got a full bathroom. Check it out. The whole back of this trailer, you got a sink over here, medicine cabinet, cedar line wardrobe, and look at this shower. This is fantastic. Look how large it is. Heated tanks and closed underbelly. And this trailer is just over 33 foot long. And uh, look at all the windows you get even in the living space. You want some privacy, just pop these down. Boom. Double entry step. Let's go find another one. Let's go over here. This is a Flying Cloud 23 front bedroom. 6,000 pound gross weight, 5,000 pound dry weight. You can either get it uh, with 300 watts of solar with no batteries or 300 watts of solar with 200 amp hours of lithium batteries. Manual stabilizer jacks, manual awning zip T with umbrella material, tankless water heater. Check out these cool screen doors. Boom. The trailer is insulated all the way around. Heated tanks with closed underbelly. Flip down our extra step here. Now check out this floor plan. You walk in, you walk right to the kitchen. You got a nice size sink over here. It's got that slide out pantry. You got some roof locker storage up top here. Three burner cooktop, convection microwave, U-shaped dinette, folds down, makes into a bed. Get your stereo system over here. Ducted air conditioning, 13,500 BTU. 6.8 cubic foot refrigerator with freezer, 12 volt compressor style. You got a wardrobe over here. Twin beds on this one, it's also available with Queen. So was the last one, 34 by 80, panoramic view. Got a shirt locker here, a television. Now what's nice about this, it has a bathroom just like the last one does in the back. It's the whole back of the trailer. You got your toilet that dumps into a black tank and a full shower over here. Plenty of room in the shower, glass door. These trailers also have transcore composite flooring underneath the vinyl floor. And then the whole underbelly is wrapped up in aluminum, so you don't see the floor underneath. Behind us, we got a Flying Cloud 27 front bedroom twin. <clears throat> Similar features to the last one. Flying Clouds all share the same system features. Check out these window awnings. <clears throat> Look at that, shades out the whole back of the trailer. There's another one that goes down the side. Got a rear bumper with bumper storage. Backup camera standard on all Airstreams except for the base camp. Look at this one, you got a rear dinette, folds out and makes it into a bed. You got a side lounge, 66 inches. This slides out, makes it into a bed. Boom, you lay the cushions flat. Center galley kitchen here with nice size sink. You got a bank of drawers over here, three burner gas cooktop, gas oven, and a slide out pantry microwave. 
plenty of storage above. You got your fridge and freezer, television. I like the Vista View windows and the skylight. You got a fantastic fan. This one's equipped with dual air conditioners. So you got 15,000 B2 and a 13.5. This is a 2023 leftover. So there are some incentives right now, extra incentives that Airstream has uh, in a rebate form uh, while supplies last until the end of this month. Privacy curtain to shut the hallway down. You got a wardrobe over here. And this is a split bath. So the shower, is on one side of the hallway. You got a fan in here, plenty of room. I'm 5'9", just for reference. And then you got your toilet area over here. Toilet, vanity, tankless water heater controls. Another twin bed model. Twins are very popular, especially here at Colonial Airstream. This one has the upper bunk bed option, so you can get all the way up here in the bunk. You got a nightstand there, panoramic view everybody loves, TV in the bedroom. And uh, very open space in this model. The decor is Seattle Mist, which happens to be the most popular. And they also have a Carolina clay. So the only difference is like the color of the seats. It would be, uh, this is gray and then the Carolina clay would be a clay color, like a tan color. All right, right now, right next door, what do we have? Uh, pottery Barn. <clears throat> This is a 2024 rear bedroom twin pottery barn. You get the power awning, sunbrella material, cool screen door guards. Look at this. Love it. When you walk inside, you got a front sofa area. Check this thing out. You can hang out here right. Solid surface countertop, you got your trash pail, and a cutboard up top. Comes with a gorgeous cutboard that goes on top of the sink. Got some storage down below. Three burner cooktop, gas oven. You do have an option, you can get a convection microwave instead. You got some overhead roof locker storage. Spice rack, knife rack, dining table folds down, makes into a bed. I love how it has these windows on your campsite. Get your TV over here, an articulating arm. All the systems are touchscreen controlled. Skylight, 15,000 B2 air conditioning, and a 13,500 in the bedroom. Hallway shuts down with privacy. There is a wardrobe here with a mirror on the back. Same shower that we were in uh, in the 27 FB Flying Cloud. In the bathroom, I love this bathroom. <clears throat> Look at this. You got your toilet, vanity, a mirror, got some sconce. Check out this cool sink. You got some tile on the wall. Another twin bed, right? So these boxes are just some of a lot of the cool stuff that you get with the Pottery Barn. But again, look at that panoramic view. I love this little lamp too. Two shirt lockers at the foot of the bed. And uh, these are quite popular. I have one in stock. I got a couple more coming in. <clears throat> All right, now we're gonna go to smaller single axle trailer. By the way, gross weight on that, 70, uh, 7,600 pounds. Gross weight on this is 5,000. This is a, a Bambi 19CB. This is a 2024, comes standard now with electric hitch jack. And you have an option of lithium batteries, no batteries, and uh, 100 watts of solar. The color that we're in here is called Dune. They do have ocean, and the only difference will be the color of the seats. It'll be blue versus gray. That awesome panoramic view. Look at this. You could just sit here and hang out, work for the day, and you could see all the way around in this. You got timbre doors type of sl sliders for your cabinets, a max fan on this model, sink, two burner gas cooktop, regular microwave, storage below. You got another drawer over here. Little pantry, dry erase board. Rich was here. Refrigerator with freezer. It's smaller, this is a lighter weight trailer. Corner double bed. This is 48 by 76. Another max fan in here. Little sink vanity area. You got a wardrobe. And the difference with this, the Bambi is a lighter weight, more value line trailer. So it has central air instead of ducted air. So the, the, the advantage of the ducted air, you get a little bit more headroom in the trailer and it's a little bit quieter. It's called quiet stream. Check this out, bathroom. You got your toilet dumps into a black tank, heated tanks and closed underbelly. Nice size shower in this one. It even has a little seat here. Roll away shower door, squeegees all of the water away when you're done. And then when you're not 
in the bathroom, the door folds in this way so you get into the bed a lot easier. There's even a TV in the bedroom that swivels around. Next door, we got another Bambi. There's a 2024 as well, you could tell because it comes with the factory electric hitch jack. Same thing, you could get uh, uh, the dual lithium batteries or no batteries. This now has 200 watts of solar. And let's talk about some of the differences because we're eventually gonna see a Caravel. So the Bambi is a, I talked about the ducted air. Well, Caravel will have ducted air. Caravel has screen door guards, aluminum entry step, will have heavy duty rock guards in the front. The battery box will be a metal box. The awning material will be Sunbrella. Uh, this is still a very high quality chair. We sell 50-50 split Caravel versus Bambi and they repeat floor plans. So it's available 16 RB, 19 CB, 20 FB and 22 FB. Caravel or Bambi. <clears throat> now this is the ocean decor I talked about earlier. Dining table folds down, makes into bed. You got two nice windows on your neighboring side. Two Max Air fans, 13,500 BTU air conditioning. Front bedroom, tamper doors over the bed. This is 48 by 78. You got some drawer storage, under bed storage, a wardrobe over here, a pantry. Look at this, you got little hooks, you got a magazine rack, you got some shoe storage, you got a dry erase board. Back here, you got your fridge and freezer. Look at this kit, this is why people pick this floor plan. That they're into cooking and like to hang out inside the trailer, this is a tremendous amount of space. Look at all the drawer storage you get on this model. Regular microwave, two burner gas cooktop, double sink, other ones will have a single sink. Storage below, trash pail, and then the bathroom, same shower that's in the 19 CB, toilet, but the vanity's on the inside. Remember on the Bambi, 19 CB was on the outside of the bathroom. Gross weight still 5,000 pounds, dry weight is just over 4,000 pounds. You need a vehicle that could tow at least 5,000 pounds to tow any of the single axle Airstream travel trailers. All right, what'd we skip? Over here, first queen bed, right? So. This is a 28 RBQ, rear bedroom queen in the International. International is a step above the Flying Cloud. You get a couple extra things over the Flying Cloud. You get a power awning. Flying Cloud will have manual awning. You also get solid surface countertops and a different decor. Same floor plans, they repeat each other. They repeat it again. This layout, 28 RB, comes with this sofa lounge that slides out, makes into a bed. You got blanket storage back behind here. You, instead of the lift up slab doors, you get sliders, stereo system, sink with cover. This is cool. A lot of people say, oh, it doesn't have a pull out sprayer. Well, it does, it's just behind there. This has 300 watts of solar on board. Available 200 amp hours lithium batteries or no batteries. Three burner gas cooktop, convection microwave or gas oven, spice rack, cooked up ventilation, 6.8 cubic foot refrigerator with freezer. Remember this floor plan? It's just like the Pottery Barn floor plan, just a different decor, different feature level. Dining table folds down, makes them do a bed. You got some Vista view windows over. This is a model year 2023, so this has a rebate incentive available. TV's over here. Love the porthole window on the bathroom. Bathroom is just like the Pottery Barn bathroom in the layout, but different decor. It's got this instead of the big round mirror. Wardrobe storage. You can shut the hallway down for privacy. Same shower. They use the same shower on 25, 27, 28, and 30 rear bedroom models. Walk around queen size bed. Again, you get that panoramic view. On earlier model years, they used to have wardrobes on either side of the bed, but in recent model years, they've updated them. When you get to queen bed, it's a lift up bed. So you can get to all your storage underneath. And then uh, decor wise, look at the floor. This is what the floor you get on an international. Also the cushions on this are called seashell. They do have an aqua color uh, cushion that you get, which is like a green blue. And uh, the upper cabinet has a really nice tone to it. Gorgeous. Over here we have a Caravel. So in a Caravel versus Bambi, a couple more differences. You get never lube hubs, never adjust brakes, and you get shocks on each wheel. They all come standard with a black tank flush, but here's the rock guard 
I was telling you about. Here's the metal battery box I was telling you about. Aluminum entry step, check this out. You don't want to bend down, you just push it in with your foot, pull it out with your foot. You get heavy duty stabilizer jacks versus the Bambi. Here's the screen door guards I talked about. Sunbrella material on the awning. This is a 19 CB four point, just like the Bambi. Dining table folds and makes into a bed. You get that beautiful panoramic view I love. Roof lockers, instead of the roll up timbre doors, you get sliders. Center galley kitchen, storage below. Two burner gas cooktop. On a Bambi, you don't get the cooktop ventilation. You don't get the higher BTUs. Uh, you also are available to get a co optional convection microwave on this model and optional 100 watts of solar with no batteries or solar with 200 amp hours of lithium batteries. You got a pantry over here, fridge with storage above and below and below the bed. 48 by 76, roof locker storage, TVs in the bedroom, fan with a shade, the vanity, wardrobe, and the same bathroom the 19 CB Bambi had with the toilet and shower. Got a roll down screen here, shade in the bedroom. Now, let's talk about decor. Uh, we're gonna leave the MSRP pricing for all these uh, uh, in the description or links to our website. This is pewter. It's also available in tungsten, and the only difference will be a satin black versus the pewter color. Everything else stays the same. The floor, the countertops, cabinets, everything. Moving down to another Bambi. This is a 2024. See that electric hitch jack. These are all steel frames boxed it's not a c channel so it's very rigid 5,000 pound gross vehicle weight rating on that one 5,000 pound gross vehicle weight rating on this one same type of tow vehicle you need we didn't open any outside storage yet but here's a trunk insulated weather sealed lockable and a light on the inside when you walk in this floor plan bathrooms right here to the back get your toilet vanity and a full shower with glass door u-shaped dinette folds down and makes into a bed look how bright and airy it is a very gloomy day here but the trailer's pretty bright got your wardrobe back here nice size fridge with freezer up top tv on an articulating arm caravel will have like digital controls for hvac it's analog controls on a bambi and again this is not ducted like the caravel flying cloud international all the way up this bed lifts up so you can get to some of the storage underneath door opens up comes with some of the plastic bins there's a headboard you got USB, USB-C. Uh, a Caravel comes with a 1,000 watt pure sine wave inverter for 2023 or a 2,000 watt pure sine wave inverter for 2024. Bambi, you don't get the inverter. You could do it as a dealer installed if you wanted. Double sink, storage below, regular microwave, two burner gas cooktop. And this color is the Dune color, which we've seen before. Over here, this is my favorite. I have a 1961 Airstream Bambi, and uh, this isn't a Bambi, but it's a Bambi size. This is 16. This is a very efficient floor plan. Rear panoramic window, window awnings all the way around, backup camera, rear bumper with bumper storage. You got all the storage underneath the bed, stabilizer jacks, all four corners, screen door guards, zip D awning, sunbrella material, aluminum entry step. You got a light by the door here. This. is the tungsten so it's like a satin black you got a drawer underneath here for storage upper roof locker storage 2024s actually have an ethernet connection on the outside and inside so if you wanted to do starlink you just plug it right in 3.1 cubic foot refrigerator 12 volt two burner gas cooktop cooktop ventilation sink with pull out sprayer tankless water heater tank monitoring system drawer, regular microwave on a 16, no option to get a convection microwave on a 16, privacy shade because what happens is when you get out of the shower, this is a wet bath, toilet and shower is one compartment, got medicine cabinet, you got shower curtains that cover everything, but when you get out, you'll have an area to get dressed in here and access your wardrobe that's in the bedroom, 
48 by 78 inch bed. TV's on an articulating arm, so you can swing it around for the dinette area. And you got storage below. So this is one of my favorite floor plans. I think it checks off all the boxes for me. And it sleeps up to four people, and it's a 4,300 pound gross vehicle weight rating. What do we have here? We have a base camp REI. This one's not open because I got an identical one inside. We're gonna head inside shortly. Back here, <clears throat> got a globe trotter. We haven't seen a globe trotter yet today. So this is a 27 front bedroom twin globe trotter. 28 tip to tip, 7,600 pound gross vehicle weight rating, 6,200 pound dry weight, tankless water he heater, heated tanks and closed underbelly, window awnings all the way around, back bumper with back bumper storage, wireless backup camera, double entry step, woven vinyl flooring throughout. Check this out. <clears throat> Open this all the way around. Look at that panoramic view. You could do two tables, one, U-shaped, folds into a bed. You got these cool upper roof lockers, backlit with mirrors on the inside. This lounge slides out, makes into a bed. Now this, there's four different decors available. Every other model is like two. So you get the dark walnut, or you could get the natural elm, so you get a lighter dark. And then there's four cushion choices. This is uh, the Copenhagen cream but they also have double and slate. It's like a dark slate color that you can get. On the lighter decor, which is a natural elm, you could get two different seating colors. London gray, which is a really light gray, or Barcelona blue, like a really bold blue. All of them are beautiful. Got nice windows over here with uh, vista views. You got a skylight. Here's the ducted air conditioning we've been talking a lot about. Solid surface countertop. You get some storage over here. Got some storage back here in these bins. You got some drawer storage instead of cabinet storage. Three drawers over here, three burner gas cooktop, gas oven, and a convection microwave. This trailer also has 300 watts of soil on the roof, also available with lithium. You got a pantry below. Same fridge we've been seeing in all the larger trailers. TV's over here on an articulating arm. Double wardrobe door. Here's all these extra filler cushions. So the difference is like on a Flying Cloud or International, the filler cushions that make the bed are actually the backrest. On a Globetrotter, there are extra pieces that you carry. Privacy curtain for the hallway, split bath with the same shower, 25, 27, 28, and 20, 30 RB have the same one. Bathrooms over here. You got your toilet, you got a vanity, you got a mirror storage up there. Twin beds, 34 by 80. You got a space between the bed and the wall on a 27 that you don't get on a 25. You get two closets in the bedroom and you get the large windows all the way around. Look at this, open them up, get the light in here. Got a nightstand up front, USB charging. I love how light the floor is inside this trailer too. <clears throat> Let's check out a van. This is a 2024 Airstream Interstate Grand Lounge GL, Tommy Bahama edition in the four wheel drive platform. Also 2024 is you could get them available with all wheel drive. So there's two different versions, two different engines, six cylinder or the four cylinder. But you got these captain chairs up front here. This has 12,000 watt hours lithium batteries. You got a rooftop full of solar, 3,200 watt inverter, dual alternator, dual DC to DC chargers, diesel heat, diesel hot water, and it's loaded. That's that E1 pack as everybody's going crazy about. Up front, you got driver passenger swivel chairs, all the best in class Mercedes Benz features, heated seats, power seats, cab window insulated blinds, 10 and a quarter display, adaptive screws control, leather wrapped steering wheel, a table assembles here. You can have all four chairs swiveled around, power shades. Look at all this roof locker storage all the way down. Up front, there's a flip down television. You also have a fantastic fan, a drawer style microwave. Flip down storage here, you get your sink. 
induction cooktop. Now these are available without the E1 package and it would have a, a propane cooktop, propane generator, 200 amp hours of lithium. 3.1 cubic foot fridge, thanks for the lights. And another drawer back here. This whole back area now, this thing folds out into almost a king size bed, 66 by over 80 inches. You don't have to extend it to full length. It's nice because you can leave stuff set up in the trunk and not have to move it out of the way. This compartment back here is huge. Look, it's all lit too. You can throw stuff all the way back there. You got a TV back here as well. And then you got a wet bath. So this is a toilet, shower, sink, everything combined. You pull this out, that becomes your shower. There's a vent fan in the ceiling. It's all fiberglass. So same bathroom, same bathroom design. They used them since 2008, a long time. It works, it works extremely well. We love it. These are also available with power stabilizer jacks. It's 11,030 pound gross vehicle weight rating. And this is 24 and a half feet long. All right, what else we have here? This is a Caravel 20 FB. Just like the Bambi 20 FB we just saw. Inside here, dining table folds and makes it into a bed. 48 by 78 inch bed up front. Wardrobe storage over here. Roof locker storage. Little pantry space over here. You've got your fridge. Again, all that counter space. People that love to cook. They love the 20 FB floor plan. Drawers, optional convection microwave, optional 200 watts of solar. Shower, toilet, vanity, everything's combined. <clears throat> the decor is the uh, pewter. I'm oh, sorry, tungsten. That's tungsten decor. What do we got over here? That one's not even open. Must be the same layout as the one in front. <clears throat> Airstream Interstate 19. This is a uh, two-wheel drive, and uh, this has uh, propane, so come on in. 200 amp hours of lithium, driver passenger swivel chairs, all the best in class Mercedes-Benz features. Everything's touchscreen controlled. Got a wet bath with toilet, shower, vanity. Smaller fridge on this model. Slide out pantry down there, and this whole back area folds into a similar bed that we just came out of, just doesn't extend longer. Microwave, air conditioning, there's your uh, cooktop. And then I didn't get to open the back doors in the other one, but back here you got some storage underneath the bed toes up to 5,000 pounds. This is on a Mercedes Sprinter 2500 series chassis, a lower GVWR. It's only 19 and a half feet long. <clears throat> All right, over here, we have a Basecamp 16X REI edition. This has 360 watts of solar, 200 amp hours of lithium, manual hitch jack up front. Check this one out. I love the details in the REI. This is a storage area. You got bungees for your storage over here. A front kitchen area. You got a smaller fridge down below. Microwave, panoramic view. You got your upper roof locker storage. There's a fantastic fan. You got your bathroom with the toilet, shower, wet bath, all combined. Has an outside shower. Every Airstream has an outside shower. You can actually pass this shower wand through the side there. And then this back is pretty cool because you could use it as twin bed, you could do a double bed, or you can convert the whole thing into a queen size bed. And then it has this door that opens in the back so you can pass cargo through. It's got the coin style floor, which is very grippy, composite flooring, boot storage over here. You got Truma heat and hot water, runs on propane. Look at these beautiful taillights. It's got a spare tire underneath. Heated tanks and closed underbelly. This is used Airstream Interstate. This is a model year 2013. This is an extended lounge model. Over here, we have the Atlas. This is uh, our last 2023 uh, leftover. These are beautiful. 11,030 pound gross vehicle weight rating, 24 and a half feet long. Mercedes Blue Tech diesel six cylinder. 
Inside, you got driver, passenger, swivel chairs. You got a table over here. This sofa folds out. You can sleep on if you want. You have power foot pedestals here. There's a power TV that comes up over here. This flips out. You got some drawer storage over here. In the back, there we go. We got some lights, got some wardrobe, another wardrobe here. Pantry space. This is cool. Check out this shower. Gorgeous. And you want privacy, you got a regular door. A lot of people ask, like, why doesn't all the Airstreams have pocket doors like this? Well, it's simple. Where the hallways are, there's wheel wells that cut into the body. It's a little bit different than a standard box style trailer that builds above the wheel wells. Airstreams are low center of gravity, so they build the wheel wells into the body. There would be nowhere for a pocket door to recess where the hallway is on some of the models. So that's why this has it. And if you go up to the 33 front bedroom classic, that has pocket doors because there's no wheel well interference. Lots of storage all the way around. And then you could get this with the full lithium package or you could get it with propane and a diesel generator or propane generator now. Come on, let's go inside. <clears throat> Welcome to Colonial Airstream. So a lot of you might be familiar with our beautiful showroom here, Millstone Township, New Jersey. We've been in this location for about three and a half years. We got some... Uh, here in a cutaway Airstream shell. This is like our centerpiece of the showroom. During our event, we have some vendors here, local vendors, national vendors. <clears throat> People just check in right here. Alex will get them into the system. You guys know Connor from the videos? Hello. We also have Kevin Nolan over there, another Airstream sales rep. Inside, we got a base camp REI 20X. There's a 30 rear bedroom twin classic inside. There's people in there, so we'll just let them be. Airstream range line. This is a Ram Promaster chassis, 3500 series, 159 inch wheelbase, extended model. Got running boards down the side. You got a retractable screen, beautiful grab handle to get in. This has the optional pop top, so you can sleep up to four people, and it has seat belts for four. Woven vinyl flooring. Driver passenger swivel chairs, you got the dining table. That swivels out so multiple people could sit. And then this chair easily swivels around. Look how open this space is here. Back here, <clears throat> what's nice is the bed folds up completely out of the way when you don't need it there. But when it's time for bed, this, this mattress would normally be on the bed. And just grab the mattress, lay it on there, and you sleep east-west on this model, right across the whole back there. You can still store stuff underneath. Nice size fridge with freezer, regular microwave, 200 watts of solar, 270 amp hours of lithium battery, wet bath. Nice cool thing about this, it's got this sink that just folds out when you need it. And then when you don't, it's out of your way. Plenty of room in here. It has a roll-away door on the side. And there's L-Track in the floor, so you can tie down all your gear. Where's the cooktop? Well, it's an induction cooktop. We have it stored in one of these drawers. And you put it out when you need it. You also have electrical outlet that pops up if you need to use that. Your sink, lots of little cubbies, roof locker storage. You got little lights here that you could angle to different positions. And all the systems are touchscreen control. And there's a ladder to get up into the bunk bed. We just have to put it away for today. And one more thing I want to show you, because I know this is a long video. Thanks for sticking around. 2024 Airstream Interstate 19 SE, 19 foot, two inches, Mercedes-Benz Sprinter, 2500 series, six cylinder, blue tech diesel engine, retractable screen. Got this that goes up and down, power entrance step. All the best in class Mercedes Benz features, power seats, heated seats, 10 and a quarter display, adaptive cruise control, leather wrapped steering wheel, get the cab area, insulated blinds, 200 amp hours of lithium batteries. 
Got your bathroom over here, toilet, sink, shower. Fantastic fan in the ceiling, 13,500 B2 air conditioning, 2500 Onan quiet series generator, sink, faucet. What's nice about this is like, there's an outside shower over there, but you can even use this too. This has a two burner gas cooktop, some storage down below here. You got a trash pail too, slide out pantry, got your fridge and freezer, wardrobes over here. TV swivels around so you can watch it from up front. The whole area in the back, this is power, just like the regular Interstate 19, folds flat. And you got some lots of storage throughout. Three-point shoulder harness for seat belts. This seats up to four people on this model. Well, guys, I hope you can make it out to our Discover America sales event here at Colonial Airstream, October 6th and 7th, 2023. Telephone number is 800-265-9019. You can visit us on our website at colonialairstream.com. Don't forget to check us out on social media on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. I'll see you soon.